What's up guys? Puddin and Brian here from the Sizz Puddin and Brian. What's up guys? Puddin and Dawson here from the Sizzle Offshore. In this episode, we take our boat to Sea Deck headquarters to get totally pimped out. And be sure to stay tuned to the end of the video because we go fishing in Mosquito Lagoon and Dawson catches redfish, trout, and the elusive whiting. We are doing something very exciting today. We are dropping off our flats boat. And a lot of you have asked, since we've had the boat, when are you getting your sea deck? So that is what we are doing today. We are here at the Sea Deck Marine Factory, and I am excited. This boat is going to look even better. It's gonna be awesome. Heading to get breakfast. We just got a spot from our buddy Jared at Sea Deck. And the boat is going to take about approximately five hours to install. So it's gonna be the longest five hours ever. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> it looks awesome. This is a brand new boat. Look at Dar Sizzle. Oh, I love it. You guys are going to love it. Can't wait to show you. Ah! Ryan and Jared did a great job on the install. It's time to get ready to go fishing tomorrow. Let's go. Oh boy guys, we're going old school today. This looks pretty sick. Nice. This is a great, great spot for like a bunch of people coming to a fish camp to hang out and have fun and go on the water. So it's just the two of us, but it's really nice and spacey. The bathroom was right back there. We got a, two beds in here. We got two more beds in there. Huge living room area and kitchen area to cook up your fish. And then you walk out back. And we got our own waterfront property. This is like, I feel so special and very lucky and blessed to do this. And we got a boat ramp right oh, here. Oh, this is pretty nice as well. Yeah. We've never fished here before, actually. I've never fished here before. Right. Darcy fished here because she's I fancy with Blair Wiggins. I fished, well, we fished in Titusville, which is still way further south than here. But I have fished Mosquito Lagoon area before. And look, I found a new cat, a new pet to take home with me. No, I'm just kidding. It's a really pretty calico cat. Friendly. Comment below if you like cats. I miss my dogs. Okay. <laughs> oh, here we go. All right, so we're gonna get settled in, enjoy our evening, and we'll see you guys in the morning for some real fishing. Yes. Ready? I'm ready. Redfish on tap. Really excited. 5:30. No joke. Tomorrow. All right. See you guys in the morning. Good morning, Dar Sizzle Nation. It's the next day, very early. We got the sun coming up. We got Jared on the boat with us, and we have just arrived to the bread fishing spot. We gotta be quiet. We got a little bit of wind this morning, and I am throwing a top water to hopefully get a redfish top water bite this morning. We're gonna see what happens. Oh, fish on, nice. You're right. First fish for me. It's a nice trout. I just try and be a little quiet because we're in the red fishing area and I don't want to yell too loud, but I just hooked my first fish. Top water trout. Pretty sweet. Is that a keeper? Yeah, that's a keeper fish. Whoa, I almost just hooked myself. Relax, buddy. Pretty sweet. I also heard that there are 10 pound gator trouts back here, which would be insane to see a giant trout like that. But Jared just caught two fish on top water, some smaller reds, and I just caught the first trout of the day. Pretty sweet, I'm excited. Beautiful morning. We're kind of back hidden behind the, hidden away from the wind today. We got a lot of wind and some, also some uh, storms coming, but that's a beautiful fish. That's my first trout in a long time first Mosquito Lagoon trout for me. These trout have to be a minimum of 15 inches long and you're allowed to keep five per person per day. So he's going in the grizzly cooler. There's a ton of fish right here. I don't know how we haven't got one. Keep on moving kind of quick. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God into the bush. <laughs> oh, 
did it! I did it! Awesome! This fish is coming right out. What is it? What is it? It's a beautiful red. Nice. That was sick. We got a red. Just flip them in. I think I can flip them in on a 15, right? Yes, we can. Hey guys, check it out. My first Mosquito Lagoon redfish today. Beautiful fish. That is a nice juvenile redfish. And it just blew up a topwater bait, a skitter walk that we were using. But I got a couple other topwater bites this morning and I missed the fish, or they the fish actually missed the lure. So I just got one and that was really cool. Okay, so you, I'm using the new Sea Deck ruler that we have here on the bow, and you can see he is 17 inches long. A slot redfish would be a minimum of 18 inches long to a maximum of 27 inches long. So this guy has got to go home. Stop it, stop it, stop it. So we're gonna release him right now, but he's got a beautiful spot. And some, some species, some redfish have a lot of spots, other redfish don't have as many spots. So he's going home, we're gonna catch a bigger fish. You take off when he's ready. There he goes. Beautiful. I'm gonna watch me sink up to my titties here. What's going on, Jared? What are you don't put those shoes on for? Oh, I gotta go get your lure out of the trees over my, there. My? <laughs> 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 That's something Pudding would say. For sure, he came to the Pudding School of Fishing. I got your lure back. Oh, thanks. I, was, I don't want to lose that one. We have been fishing all day, not giving up on trying to catch more redfish and trout. And I have got a few hits throughout the day, but just never hooked up officially and a bunch of bites on top water. And I just caught first fish in a while, which is a whiting. And a whiting is usually found on the beaches here in Florida. He's really wiggly. And they're actually very, very good to eat. And he almost looks like he's part of the drum family. He's got that shaped face like a black drum and a red drum. And they do get much bigger than this. So we're gonna go ahead and release him. But pretty cool, I have never caught a whiting before. Hooked up, we just got almost a double up. Pretty close, what do you got? Redfish. Redfish! All right, I gotta get a line back in the water and get one myself. All right, here he comes. Hey everybody, this is Jared from Sea Deck. He's the man over there, showing us all about Mosquito Lagoon. Now, if Dawson could catch the fish, we'd have we'd have a great show, wouldn't we, everybody? Hey, now that's his first fish. <laughs> that's his first fish that was actually filmed today. Actually. Everyone tells us about how good Jared is at fishing, but I honestly, Darcy caught the biggest redfish and the only fish we can put in the cooler to eat, so I don't know about this Jared guy. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks. Thanks a lot. Don't worry, no one's watching, Jared. Don't worry, no one watches. No one's seen this. Don't worry. Back at the ramp, cleaning up the boat. We got to get back on the road and head home to see Megan Solo and Dad Sizzle. And we had an epic time up here in... Rockledge, Florida, and also here at the Mosquito Lagoon. And we can't thank Jared enough for showing us around Mosquito Lagoon today. And I had a lot of great blow ups on top water, but honestly, the fish missed the lure. Five <laughs> good fish. Yeah, you know these fishermen so, talk. No, I really, but I mean, you're never gonna know. So we did, we did catch how many redfish? Like six or seven redfish? Yeah. A couple trout. Yep. A, a whiting. The elusive whiting. Yep. And lots of mullet, so lots of bait around. We can't complain about that. And a bunch of other blow ups, all on top water, which you guys know, it's a load of fun, you know? So, and uh, yeah. all lures, so we're real fishing. Yeah, awesome. and we went through a couple storms, so, and we were just learning a new area and getting stuck a lot in the flats boat. But, <laughs> you know, that's all part of the learning process and just figuring out new areas. And our boat's never been here before, so now we know. All right. So, thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope y'all enjoyed it. Once again, stay tuned because we're going to be making a full video on the details about this flats boat that you guys have been asking for. Yep. But also we have a lot of great videos coming out so subscribe hit the bell notification so you receive updates and don't miss out when our new videos get posted and until our next adventure follow your dream and, and keep, keep on, on catching, catching. you sounded so silent i sound i was I letting sound you like leave you. the spotlight don't oh. forget the bracelets too this is in the, in the after part there fishhook and anchor bracelets that's just love woo woo christmas great patriotic christmas see you later jared see that rocks rocks best